Hey family, brother Adam coming to you from South Boston. We're about to hit the streets of SatanCon. Brother Hank's on his way to pick me up. But family, this bag was filled with Bibles. I got like 14 of them left. I got out so many on the way up here at the bus stop. Got some tracks right there. So next time you see me, I'll be with brother Hank. Let's go. You're bringing judgment of the land. Judgment. At the name of Jesus. You may not know him, but you're going to know him one day. Your church is hell Satan, and you have such a heavy, high-minded look to you. My soul is weeping for you. We should never walk with our nose in the air like we're better than anybody. Every person that follows the Satan's movement, you wonder why you look the way you look. You have a heavy and high-minded mindset. Tell YouTube, hey. Hey, YouTube, we're here at SatanCon 2023. We're going to preach the gospel. You see, there's a lot of people out here, a lot of a lot, a lot of people going against this, and a lot of people that are against it as well. Uh, we've been meeting a lot of people out here, so the Spirit of the Lord goes before us in the battle. We're getting ready to preach here soon against the abortion rallies, against the transgender movement and all that. So, uh, you know, be tuning in and watching it and praying in spirit. May God bless you. Glory to God. Family, look at this. Step one, you get down on your knees like this. Come here. You come here. Go lay down, you fucking fool. That's not nice. Everything all right? Come on, man, I'll stay here with us. Okay. okay, it says here, this is Jesus speaking, he says, When the Son of Man comes in his glory and all the holy angels with him, then he will sit on the throne of his glory. All, na all the nations will be gathered be before him. So, so it says all the all the all the nations will be gathered before him. And he will separate them one from another as the shepherd divides his sheep from the goats. And he will set the sheep on his right hand, but the goats on his left. Then the king will say to those who, who is on his, on his right hand, Come, you blessed of my father's door in which you can enter. You can enter through no other door. But Satan is saying that, hey, I, 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 I want to, you to follow me. Jesus says, Come to me, all you who are heavy laden, I'll give you rest. He says, uh, if you really want to be my disciples, pick up your cross and follow me. He's saying to, to lead the ways of the world and, and, and follow me, follow my ways, because in the end, you're going to find out that uh, that Satan's ways is going to lead you to hell. There's a place called heaven, and there's a place called hell. And these bodies, these bodies that we're walking around in are temporal, and eventually they're going to come to an end. And, and when, when they do come to an end, we're going to go one way. We're going to all stand before a judge, and this is going to be an eternal judge. This person is, is, is has eternal life for, for or eternal death for those who choose to follow. So it's up to us on who we're going to follow. On that judgment day, we're going to be judged either for righteousness or holiness. <laughs> hey, can you pull this off? <laughs> yeah. So, so there's a there's a way that there's a way that is um, absolutely, absolutely. Absolutely. This, this verse is, is, is God here in John chapter 9. If we confess our sins, he, he is faithful and just to forgive us of our sins so and cleanse us from all unrighteousness. So judgment of the land. Judgment. At the name of Jesus. You may not know him, but you're going to know him one day. Your shirt says hell Satan and you have such a heavy, high-minded look to you. My soul is weeping for you. We should never walk with our nose in the air like we're better than anybody. 
anybody. No one's better than anyone. We all fall short. We need that blood of Jesus today. We need the blood of Jesus today. It's the blood that sets you free. To come out here today. I'm going to to come out here today. And God bless every one of the pastors preaching today. You gotta repent. You gotta believe. You gotta be set free. You gotta be born again. You wonder why when you're following the Satanist movement, you wonder why you feel empty. The Bible tells us in John 8, if the Son makes you free, you shall be free indeed. Amen. For God so in the world, He gave His only begotten Son, and whoever well, believes in Him should not perish, but have eternal life. Appreciate it, Harry. Romans 6 6, knowing this, that my whole man was crucified with Him, that the body of sin might be done away with, and I am no longer a slave to sin. Serving a false god or a real god. When you come to the waters of life, you become new. You become refreshed. You never have a hunger. You never have a thirst again. Hallelujah. We see you again. Sister Erica. Hey, Sister Erica. Sister Erica, right? Yes. God bless you. Here. Sister Erica. Amen. 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 Thank you. God bless you. I got you. I got you. This is important. This is important. Very important. See, I was once confused in my life, too. Amazing grace. How sweet the sound. Okay, family, look, now we're out here. This is the Satanic Temple headquarters. Our group's about to pray outside this thing. This is located in Salem, Massachusetts. The watchmen have invaded the Satanic Temple, and we're about to pray. Out here at the Satanic Temple headquarters, what? Salem, Massachusetts. Look at this blasphemy right here.